hear this. You are not alone. This is the resistance. What's up everyone? This is the Tin Man with the Resistance. If you're watching this, you are the resistance. And this video is an update on the slumlord of the apartment complex in Reddington, Pennsylvania. If you don't know what video I'm talking about or what the hell I'm talking about, the link to the previous video is listed below in the description. But for those of you who do know, you know that there is a slumlord in Reddington, Pennsylvania who's evicting an elderly disabled woman because the building itself is infested with bed bugs. And this elderly woman is being stuck taking the blame along with a whole mess of other shit. Again, watch the previous video. I don't care to repeat myself. But I've been keeping up with my buddy who, if you have watched that previous video and have seen the comments, you now know to be YouTuber Billy Mustin. Well, I've been talking with Billy the past several weeks in regards to this matter. He's been keeping me up to date on what's been going on. And a lot of people who have seen this video have contacted this slumlord and have voiced their disgust. And have, and this video has generated a great deal of support for not only this elderly woman who's being targeted by this slumlord, but also the tenants of this building as well. Several of the tenants have left. The credibility of this slumlord is shot and no new renters are coming from the reports that I am receiving. And it's just bad news all around for this individual. But this individual, this slumlord, told my buddy Billy and his wife that she challenges me to make another video. Well, here it is. This video is pushing for even more support. Because something I found out today, despite everything that's going on, this dumb dumb refuses to listen. Just blind, deaf, and stupid. She knew dum dum, she give me gum gum. That fucking stupid. And is still pushing to evict this elderly woman. Now this elderly woman has found a new apartment but cannot yet move in. Yet this landlord is pushing for an immediate eviction within the next day or so. It goes to court and this will be in a day or so and if it doesn't end favorable for this lady, the elderly woman, then she will have to be out with no place to go. And I told my friend, take it to court challenge this person. She's already lost her credibility. She's already totally screwed herself royally. So take it to court and present the facts. I told him to contact the person who fumigated that building and have them subpoenaed to come into court and testify as to where the blame lies. Along with a few other suggestions. Now, if you've got a you YouTube universe, the world, whoever is watching, if you know a great deal about renters' rights, especially the laws and whatnot governing such matters in Pennsylvania, go ahead and leave a comment below. My friend Billy will be keeping watch over these comments as well as I will, and. I'm sure he welcomes all the support and suggestions that they can get. So go ahead, show your support. Let's put an end to slum lords and let's get fair treatment for the elderly and all tenants. Because it's not fair that just because somebody's old 
or they don't have a great deal of leverage that people around them can just walk all over them. It's not right and it's not fair. That's what we're combating in the New World Order issue. You know, people walking over the little guy. And who's going to stand up for the little guy? You know what? Here I stand. I see other people standing. Let's stop this shit. You know, there was a saying in the the movie Evan Almighty and and putting the word arc into an acronym. One one act of random kindness. More or less stating that you can't change the rule world all at once. But to make the world a better place, it's one step at a time. Just one act of random kindness at a time. One simple action of taking a stand and doing what's right. Whether it's combating the New World Order or just standing up to the actions of a corrupt landlord and knocking them off their high horse. Change can happen and it is possible. But it takes the effort. So stand with me as I take a stand and support my friend Billy Mustin against this corruption in his own backyard. This is the Tin Man with the Resistance. If you're watching this, you are the Resistance.